Oh, what? Who goes there? Oh, goodness gracious, man. You have startled me ever so slightly. Ugh. Oh, now that you're here, I'd rather just introduce myself. My name is St. Augustine of Hippo. Oh, you can just call me Austin for short. But what the heck are you doing here following me around, you devious stranger? Um, I'd like to know more about you. Oh, yes, of course, of course. Everybody needs to know that. But I will be explaining that in a series of complicated, yet understated, manners. Now then, I was born on November 13th, 354 AD in Tagast, Numidia. Or what is now known of as Souk Aras, Algeria. Now then, let me introduce you to my parents. But first off, we're going to start with my father. This is my father. His name was Patricius Aurelius. Now, during my father's time of living, he was the town's councillor. His job was to collect the town's taxes. His habits were a bit troublesome though, as he often worried about his daily work and routine. Yet I never understood why though. He would easily get mad however. My father actually owned a bit of land himself. He also owned a vineyard as well. It was actually run by slaves though. But his main priority was to collect the town's taxes. Hello, good sir. I need to collect your taxes, please. But of course. Here you go. Now, let us go forth to visit my caring mother. This is my mother. Her name is the one and only and legendary Saint Monica. Hooray. Anyways, my mother was born in the same place I was in the year 331. She was married to my dad, Patricius. Though, like I said, they never got along quite nicely. But they always respected each other. My mom actually gave birth to three children, including me. There was I, Nevergeus, and my sister Perpetua. Hey guys, it's Augustine here again. Now I'm going to be telling you major events that have happened throughout my life. But sadly, I'm only going to be telling you only five. Whoa! Yes, yes, I know. No need to start around. Ah, the memories. I still always remember the time I was baptized by St. Ambrose in the year 387. Ah, St. Augustine. I see if you've come a long way to try and do this. May I remind you that this will convert you to Christianity and will change your life forever. Now, step into the water to be blessed in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. You are now blessed, my good ward. I'll also remember the time I decided to teach grammar during 373 to 374. Hello there, class. My name is St. Augustine, and I am going to be teaching you some grammar today. On second thought, maybe I'll just decide to move to Carthage to recite rhetoric. I also remember the time I was accepted by being the role of the professor of rhetoric in 384. I hereby declare this award to being the role of professor of rhetoric in 384. Give it up for St. Augustine. Yay, 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 yay. I still do remember that I was ordained a priest in 391 in Hippo Regius of Algeria. I hereby ordain Saint Augustine and his brilliant works of art to be ordained a priest to the society. Congratulations Saint Augustine. Ah <laughs> oh, yes, hooray, another life goal completed. And last but not least, I still remember the time I published my 13 books called Confessions during 397 to 398. Oh, finally, my brilliant works of art have now been completed and I can't wait for everybody to see my brilliant work of art. Saint Augustine of Hippo later died on August 28th, 430 AD. It is unknown of how he died, but it was due from a sickness. His date of canonization is on 1303 and he was canonized by Pope Boniface VIII. His feast day is on August 28th.